Well, hello there, my friends. Chris Marcus here with you for Arcadia Economics. And today we have a quick video about some drill results that were released from Fortuna Silver this morning. So I wanted to walk you through the details here. Obviously, as you can see in the headline, the main intersect was a 90.9 grams per ton gold reading over 1.8 meters at Barana in their Seguela location in Cote d'Ivoire. And to start off, we have a comment from Paul Whedon, the Senior VP of Exploration at Fortuna. And he mentions, infill drilling at the Sunbird deposit to upgrade geologic confidence has concluded. The next phase of estimation, optimization, and design having commenced. And with that underway, the focus has now returned to generating new anomalies and testing prospects with positive surface results at Barana, such as the 90.9 gram per ton drill hole that I just mentioned. They also did drilling at Yaramoka, where the high-grade mineralization extended at least 130 meters beyond the current resource to the west and included intervals such as 32.8 grams per ton gold over a true width of 3.1 meters. And outside of West Africa, they also did some testing at their Babarigami project in Mexico, intersecting mineralized zones, including 2.7 grams per ton and 155 grams per ton over an estimated true width of 4.04 meters. And here we see the Sunbird highlights, which include 12.7 grams per ton over a true width of 18.9 meters from 147 meters, 22.2 grams per ton over 2.1 meters from 115 meters, 7.5 over 23.8 meters from 128, 16.2 over 8.4 meters from 270, 8.7 over 2.8 meters from 151, 4.7 over 13.3 meters over 81 meters, and 10.7 grams per ton over 5.6 meters from 199 meters. The infill drilling for increased geologic confidence at the Sunbird deposit has been completed with 47 holes drilling 11,075 meters of the expanded 15,000 meter program, which was increased 9,500 meters due to positive results. Drilling has intersected high-grade mineralization close to the margins of the pit optimized limit, and these results will be incorporated into an updated mineral resource and mineral reserve estimate prior to pit optimization or revised Seguela Life of Mine update plan for the fourth quarter. Here you can see the Sunbird long section showing the recent drilling results, so certainly can pause that and take a closer look. At Barana and Badior, the results included the previously mentioned 90.9 grams per ton over a true width of 1.8 meters from 43 meters, 1.4 over 8.1 meters from 77 meters, 2.4 over 5.4 meters from 67 meters. Those were all from Barana, and at Badior, they had 4.9 grams per ton over a true width of 12.6 meters from 110 meters. 30 holes were drilled, totaling 3,900 meters to test the strike extent and continuity of mineralization identified in the first scout drilling program. And there is further drilling planned for later in 2023. Here you can see the drill results from Barana and Body Ore. And again, you can pause this to take a closer look. Also, the link to this press release will be included in the description field below, so you can take a look through it there as well. And as I mentioned, they also had some drill results from their Yaramoko mine in Burkina Faso, where they did a total of 29 holes, including 7,011 meters that tested the strike and vertical extent of the high-grade extensions to the Zone 55 mineralization to the west and limited strike extent testing to the lower east levels of the underground operation, which will allow Fortuna to provide an updated mineral resource and reserve estimate for Yaramoko before the end of the year. Results at the Zone 55 drilling include 9.6 grams per ton over a true width of 5.5 meters from 254 meters, 32.8 over 3.1 meters from 287.9 meters, 13.2 grams over 4.6 meters from 302 meters, 8.9 grams over 8.2 meters from 120.95, and 8.8 .8 grams over 8.6 meters from 140.1 meters. The drilling has intersected new high-grade mineralization beyond the 2022 mineral resource, with the recent mine development extending 130 meters beyond the previous design, and they will be continuing to drill there in the second half of this year. 
Here you can see the location and results of the drill readings at Yaramoko, where a step out drilling to the east has continued to identify mineralization beyond the limits of the 2022 mineral resource boundary. And again, drilling will be continued in the second half of 2023. And lastly, at the Baba Rigmi project in Mexico, 14 diamond drill holes were done over two phases, totaling 3,900 meters as a proof of concept evaluation of the project. Results there include 2.7 grams per ton gold and 155 grams per ton silver over a true width of 4.04 meters from 192 meters. 2.4 grams gold, 314 grams silver over a true width of 2.04 meters from 188 meters and 3.3 grams per ton gold, 538 grams per ton silver over 1.2 meters from 191 meters with the exploration drilling focused on testing key structural zones beneath the high level epithermal expressions observed on surface with 10 of the 14 holes returning positive results that warrant further work and further drilling is also scheduled there for the second half of 2023 to target the western extension of Cebolas West and the undrilled Los Pinos structure where they got rock sampling results that returned up to 10 grams per ton gold and 369 grams per ton silver. And in this map, you can see the results that they returned at that project in Mexico. So again, the link to this press release, so you can take a look through it for the details, is in the description field below. Congratulations to Fortuna on getting some positive results from their latest drilling programs. And I'm going to wrap up for now, but thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you again soon.